Hello, this is Kate from katewinch.com and today's Tap Into Magic video is on releasing grief. Oh my goodness, grief is such a heavy emotion, right? And being human, we do not escape that. Whether we're going to lose a loved one, passing away, or whether a relationship ends, or a situation that you loved end, a job, or a whatever, right? Or even if you're single and you get married, sometimes you feel sad about losing your single life, or maybe you become a parent and you, you know, there's happiness and sadness at the same time. So what I'd like you to do is tune in to some grief and sadness. Perhaps you're going through a loss right now, or a breakup, or a death. Give it a number 0 to 10. 10 is high, 0 is low, and tap along. Repeat after me. So tap on the karate chop point. <sighs> Even though I have this deep grief and sadness, and this heaviness in my heart, and I don't know how I can let it go. Maybe it doesn't seem possible. I've had this grief for so long. I wonder who I'd be without it. Close your eyes, deep breath. You can change the words to fit your situation to keep tapping. Even though I have this deep grief and sadness about this loss, I'm so sad about it. And I feel guilty about the fact I could have done more, or I should have done things differently. Part of me thinks it's my fault. And I don't know how to let this go. Maybe it doesn't feel safe. I can't relax about this. I have to be on guard. But I accept who I am. And I appreciate how I feel. Close your eyes, deep breath. Even though I have this deep grief and sadness. And this heaviness in my heart. I don't know how I can ever get over this loss. But I choose to love and accept myself anyway. Close your eyes, deep breath. <sighs> and then we're going to the eyebrows, this deep grief and sadness. All this loss. All this heaviness in my heart. All this shock and trauma. This hurt and pain. This deep sadness and grief. I'm so devastated by this loss. I'm so hurt by this loss. It's hard to imagine my life without this person or situation. All this attachment to them. All this resistance to what's so wishing they were here now. All this loss of power. This feeling of helplessness and hope hopelessness. Feeling so bad. All this guilt and shame about what I did or didn't do. If only I'd done things differently. Part of me thinks it's my fault. This guilt and shame about this loss. This fear and worry about the future. How can I live without them? This fear of living without them. All this grief and sadness. All this loss, 
all this anger about this loss. It's so unfair. It feels so hard. This deep grief and sadness. This hurt and pain. All this loss. All this fear and worry about the future without this person. All this anger, this heavy grief and sadness. It's so exhausting. And I have suffered so much about this. I'd really like to let it go. I'd love to feel a little lighter. I'd love to feel a little relief. Because I have suffered and cried about this for so long. This deep grief and sadness. This deep grief and sadness. All this hurt and pain. All this loss. And letting it go. Letting it go. I'm allowed to let it go. I deserve to let it go. It's safe to let it go. It's possible to let it go. I'm allowed to let it go. Choose to let it go. Choose to honor my feelings. Feel my feelings. Honor the relationship or situation I had. Celebrate the good that was there, all the good things that happened in that connection that I got to love so deeply. I call all my power back from all dimensions of time and space. It's safe to be powerful. It's safe to shine. It's safe to live. I choose to live my best life in their honor. That's what they want for me. They would want me to be happy and live my best life. So, I choose to follow my dreams, move in the direction of my dreams, shine brightly and live fully and celebrate them in my life by living my best life now. Close your eyes, deep breath. Zero to 10. Hopefully you're feeling lighter. I know grief is such a, a tricky thing, right? Um, sometimes you think, oh, I feel better, and then it comes back and so you want to tap. I tap daily if you're dealing with a big loss. Play this video every day. Tap on all the different things like I miss them. Or the regret. If only I'd done something differently. Or it's my fault. All the stuff that can come up. The anger at them for leaving. Or the anger at yourself for perhaps you felt you contributed to the loss. So um, journal about it. Feel your feelings and tap daily. The tapping is great because it really helps move the energy, that heavy energy in your body and your mind, of course. And um, I love tapping on, I choose to feel a little relief. Like when you're in that heavy grief, you can't really go from there to woohoo, I feel great. Like you're never gonna be jumping up and down about this loss, or maybe you are at some point. Um, maybe it will make sense, you know, if a relationship's ended or some change. Look for the gold. Like, what are the gifts that come out of this loss? It's hard to see, right? Because, you know, we're so sad when we lose a loved one. But sometimes it can open our heart and transform us. Grief can be transforming. And to live fully and be open to love again. So... Um, if you have questions, you can email me, sign up for my free newsletter. I do free tapping calls. Um, you'll hear all about them through the letter newsletter on my website down there. 
just uh, fill out the form and if you have questions or you'd like a tap into magic free consultation to see about how I can best support you you can email me on the contact page I'm sending you so much love and take good care of yourself right drink lots of water have Epsom salt baths journal call a friend um, acts of service you know when you're having a hard time actually helping others can really be a relief and put your energy on others too and just make sure you get your needs met like get the support you need often we are struggling on our own and to give yourself the gift of support is one of the most loving things you can do so don't do this alone if you're going through grief okay sending you much love thanks so much for watching many blessings